And now, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for the main event. It is a professional full Muay Thai rules match and the finals of the Journey Fight Series 160 pound tournament for the WMC North American title. It will be contested over five rounds of three minutes with a two minute rest period in between rounds. The trophies and the bout brought to you by Team Smandich Muay Thai, Century Casino, Ensign Energy Services, Global Steel, The Shooting Edge, JourneyFightSeries.com, and United Protection Security Group, Inc. In the blue corner, fighting out of Shaolin Muay Thai, trained by Kruelin, weighing in at 160 pounds with a complete record of 60 wins, 10 losses, 27 by way of knockout. He is the WKA and WMA world champion. Please welcome to the ring, Shane Shaolin Campbell. Campbell. Shane Campbell making his way to the ring. Impressive record, 60 wins, 10 losses, 27 KOs. WK and w, WKA and WMA World Championship titles to his credit. Coming out with his entourage, looking for a fantastic fight here, taking on Calgary's shotgun, Sean McKinnon. This bout brought to you by Team Spandich Muay Thai, Century Casino, Enzyme Energy Services, Global Steel, The Shooting Edge, JourneyFightSeries.com, and United Protection Security Group, Inc. This is gonna be a burn burner. And in the red corner, fighting out of Team Smandich Muay Thai in Calgary, trained by crew Trevor Smandich, weighing in at 160 pounds with a record of 36 wins, seven losses, 14 by way of knockout. Please welcome to the ring your hometown athlete, Shotgun, Sean McKinnon. McKinnon. We've seen Sean McKinnon really grow over the last year as a fighter, adding more tools to his toolbox, improving as he uh, climbs up the professional ranks here, taking on ultra experienced Shane Campbell. Over 100 fights of fight uh, experience in the ring here between these two fighters. This should be exciting. Sean's a pretty cool customer in there, and the, uh, yeah, like he's mentioned, the growth of his, his fight game has been, has been really, you know, it's been, impressive in the last few fights i've been watching his diversity is, is what's really been impressing me so and you know that's what you need is you become into the professional ranks you want to diversify that's an important part of the evolution of a fighter how do you look for this fight to go i mean i see shane shane campbell always comes out hard he's got the fitness to go the whole distance but usually comes out swinging pretty hard yeah he lots puts, of tools in the toolbox yeah he puts his combinations together really well he's a strong strong puncher he's well, he's a big kid he's a tough kid but you know they're similar in stature size yeah sean's both fighters very, six feet tall yeah sean's a very stubborn fighter himself and you know can obviously take a shot but um and and you know sean does present some different types of challenges for a fighter too but uh shane likes to put the hurt put the hurt on a guy so We'll see how it plays out. Yeah, our last fight, uh, Shane Campbell taking on uh, 
Troy Sheridan, who had a relatively tight defense, but uh, went home with a, you know, it was a tough, tough fight for uh, for young Troy Sheridan taking on such an experienced guy in Shane Campbell. And he went home having learned a lot from Shane Campbell, the loss to Shane Campbell. Uh, again, Campbell more experienced than McKinnon this time around as well. So we will see how this one goes down. McKinnon doesn't generally take a lot of uh, abuse, pretty elusive in the ring. So we'll see if uh, Campbell's able to corner him and put the herd on him, as Lindsay says, because that's definitely what he'll be looking to do. Short round away by McKinnon. We're ready to go. Fighters uh, getting final adjustments from their coaches. Sean McKinnon sporting the ultra tough Chuck Norris beard. Chuck Norris ginger ninja beard, yeah. Fighters up. Okay, gentlemen, five rounds of full Muay Thai. Expect a good clean fight. Protect yourself at all times. Obey my commands at all times. Touch them up. The culmination good luck both of you guys. Uh, the tournament right here tonight. Yeah, a culmination of a year's worth of fights. Yeah. Three, four different fight cards building up tonight here. Here we go. Game on. We go. Camel's going to start quick by the look of things. Yeah. He's wanting to try to find some range there. McKinnon uh, looking calm. Throws a nice drop shift. And another. Campbell seems to be comfortable with that range. Nice cut kick by <laughs> Both Both fighters about, uh, going over the ropes. <laughs> I expect McKinnon to be pretty patient here this yeah. round. Sean keeping a nice tight guard. And uh, Campbell giving some movement. Nice roundhouse kick by McKinnon. Catching Campbell off a little bit. Tries to go after the supporting leg that time. Nicely done. Oh, kind of an different type of roundhouse kick. There's a good cut kick checked by uh, checked by Campbell. Campbell wanting to press in. Again, of note for our fight fans watching here on TV, these are three minute rounds, this professional fight. Yeah. Two minute rest between rounds, five rounds. Campbell's really wanting to set in. You can tell both fighters, uh, both fighters, uh, Shane's got a bit of a, like a, a crasher's type of style. When you throw, he throws, and that could be really difficult. Both he really looks to be, he wants to go, but he yeah. knows that he needs to be patient. Yeah. Good right hook, left knee combo just missing by Campbell. Count, oh, nice roundhouse kick there by, uh, by McKinnon. Just up to the gloves of uh, Shane Campbell. You can see the difference between professional fighters, really tight guard, nothing yeah. clear landing. Yeah, you've got to be real patient in your game with, at this level. Campbell with an under uppercut with an overhand right. McKinnon throws a knee. Nothing too telling in there. Campbell almost appears like he almost like he talks to himself a little bit. Oh, dropping an elbow. Oh. Nice toss by uh, by Sean. But uh, Campbell was up trying to drop an elbow there. Oh, good roundhouse kick. Oh! And that one just missed. Nice Big move, points yeah. for Campbell there, actually. Uh, when Working you throw that kick over the head. Yeah. Head. Uh, McKinnon stepping forward, patient in his guard. Campbell's providing some more movement. Campbell's pressing, but uh, like I say, Sean's tight and guarded. Campbell with a different style of roundhouse kick, taking the glove, rips cut kick, uh, catches foot on the thigh. Oh, big right hook, nice counter there by Campbell, the left roundhouse kick. You're right, Lindsay. Do you see a Campbell's lips in there moving? He, do, he does. He's telling yeah. himself what the message is. So <laughs> like, uh, good for him. Whatever works. It's picked him up. 61 wins. Yeah, exactly. I'm not. I'm not going to argue his, uh, his strategy at all. Both fighters uh, moved well in the round. You know, you get a little bit of nervous energy. Nothing. Not that they look nervous, but there's always a little bit of nervous energy in there for the first round, especially a fight of this magnitude for both guys. 
Right. Take a look at the feature productions replay here. See Campbell lining. Both fighters almost going over the top ropes early in the fight. Watching a replay there. McKinnon dumping Campbell down. And Campbell returning the favor, just missing with the roundhouse kick. Note we have a nice long break here, two minute break in the professional ranks, five rounds of three minutes. This bout brought to you by Team Spanish Muay Thai, Century Casino, Enzyme Energy Services, Global Steel, The Shooting Edge, JourneyFightSeries.com, and United Protection Security Group. We're in Calgary here for Journey Fight Series 9. Fantastic new promotion run over the last couple of years, uh, putting the best fighters in North America against each other in tough competition, fighting on multiple events, building fan favorites as the fighters work their way through the tournament to the main event where they get to compete for a WMC title as well as their shot at $10,000, the $10,000 winner's fight purse. See the two athletes getting their instruction from their coaches, both fighters fit and composed and experienced and determined. So we will see how the rest of this fight goes down. <laughs> Round two coming at you this main event here in Calgary, Journey Fight Series 9. McKinnon versus Campbell. Back we go for round two. Campbell touches gloves. Looks like he's uh, got a little look of determination. Wants to press forward. Being ever weary of, sh of uh, Sean's tight guard. Oh, good strong roundhouse kick. Nice work there by McKinnon. Beautifully done. Oh, both fighters down to the canvas. Campbell landing on top. Sean McKinnon steps forward, right, left, with the left roundhouse kick. Campbell trying to find that range. Nice jab to a left elbow, but it didn't get through the guard. McKinnon very content to wait it out here and see what's yep. coming. McKinnon very patient. Yeah, very patient, which is good to see. Campbell, nice body hook, great cut kick. Campbell patient in his own right, just this is yep. not his typical yeah, just, style. Yeah, he's more, he's more of an in-your-face top fighter, yep. but he's still very cautious with what he throws. Yeah. Picks in his spots, looking for his opening. Yeah, definitely professional. Campbell trying to close that gap on the jab. Nice roundhouse kick, catches McKinnon's ribs. McKinnon throws one of his own counter with a low kick by Campbell. Right hand, teeped off by Campbell, didn't quite get through. Campbell closing gap, McKinnon content to move. Drops in with the right hand. Campbell's trying to, trying to step in, nice cut kick there by McKinnon, checked by Campbell. Right hand by McKinnon, and chopped at by, by uh, Campbell. Oh, just missing the right round, or left roundhouse kick. Campbell trying to throw a punch at the same time. McKinnon with a teep to the face, and then one to the stomach for Campbell. Campbell doesn't seem too phased by it. He's ready to rock. Another teep by McKinnon. Right uppercut by Campbell as he switches to southpaw. Now back to orthodox. Good switch to a teep there from cut kick by Sean McKinnon. McKinnon with a nice strong teep. Sends Campbell back and he's back up. Look, uh, these two are going after one another. Oh, <laughs> heavy leather getting tossed here. Right hook. <laughs> Both fighters. You really don't see how hard they're throwing until they actually land something. The both fighters are playing, having good defense. Not a lot of shots yeah. landing. Oh, big right when they do, McKinnon just these guys are throwing hard. Stepped in with the left hook. Oh, high roundhouse kick by McKinnon, slapping off the shoulder of, of Campbell. Campbell's trying to close the gap into the clinch. Nice toss there by Campbell. McKinnon's tied up in the ropes a little bit. A little bit of blood coming out of the nose. Ten of, second uh, clacker Campbell. here. Campbell, nice, oh, big combination, but locked up by McKinnon. Nice closing statement there by, uh, by Campbell, trying to 
slash away with some elbows. Yeah, fin finishing hard in that round. That's the, the Shane Campbell we know really going after you, and that's what he did. So Campbell's we'll see. got some blood trickling from the left nostril. Campbell really went after him there in the last uh, 10 seconds, really pushed the pace. Here's the replay here. Campbell uppercut just misses. Elbow by McKinnon just misses. Right hand by a couple connections there by uh, Shane Campbell. Good second round. Great night of fights here, culminating, culminating with our main event of the evening. Shane Campbell taking on Sean McKinnon of Calgary for the WMC North American title. And $10,000. In. Campbell firing hard late kick back to McKinnon. Cut kick there, landed by McKinnon. Good job, both fighters uh, still trying to find a chink in the armor for both guys. They really started to go out at their nice cut, nice, nice catch and uh, and sweep there by Shane Campbell. Beautifully done. And oh, McKinnon tries. Campbell landing a cut kick of his own. Kidding pressing forward. Oh, catch his knee mostly there on that cut kick. That's gonna swell in the morning. Nice roundhouse kick up high off the hands of Campbell. Campbell closes the gap. He's into the clinch here. McKinnon locks up, throws for a round knee. Good try and spin there by Campbell. Both fighters really working here now. Oh, big elbow there by McKinnon, landed strong, but Campbell took it like a champ and hammers a cut kick home. Another cut kick by Campbell. Campbell has nice cut kicks, he sinks yeah. him in hard. Kick there by Campbell, <clears throat> just grazing McKinnon's lips. Oh, another heavy cut kick by Campbell. McKinnon throws a kick of his own. <clears throat> Campbell's really starting to press the action, and, and here's where a uh, fighter as Sean about two years ago wouldn't have been able to back up and fight like this as, as well. He's improved so much. Big right hand by uh, McKinnon, just misses. Campbell starting to find his groove here, landing that cut kick pretty steadily. Checked by McKinnon that time. McKinnon throws one of his own. Checked by Campbell. Campbell digs in with that body hook. Trying to swarm, big elbow there, countered by Sean McKinnon. <laughs> oh, leaping so elbow leaping. by Campbell. McKinnon pressing back, jab, right roundhouse kick. Campbell throws the hook into the guard. Oh, off balance. But body hook by McKinnon. Campbell's trying to swarm. McKinnon's arms are in the way. Nothing getting through real clean. McKinnon's countering with knees. Oh, spinning elbow just missed. Campbell with a nice sweep attempt. Both fighters in southpaw stance. Very well done. 
exciting third round. Campbell finding his groove here a little bit. Yeah, starting to find a home for that cut kick, and uh, Sean started to throw some nice elbows, ta nicely timed elbows yeah. on the swarm. Definitely some good elbows. Punch Just missed on that spinning elbow. Yeah. Future Productions replay here. There's Shane Campbell coming in, catching the teep from uh, McKinnon and dumping him down on the ground with a leg sweep and looking over him. McKinnon throwing the high roundhouse just off the gloves of Campbell. You see Campbell coming in on this one. Oh, catching a right elbow for his troubles. Nothing phasing Campbell. Very creative move, a little leaping uh, short right elbow there by Campbell. Clever shot landing on McKinnon. Another exciting round, moving into late rounds here as I expected, I didn't uh, didn't think this would end early. Couple of very composed professional fighters, lots of experience in the ring. Boat brought to you by Team Spanish Muay Thai, Century Casino, Enzyme Energy Services, Global Steel, The Journey, The Shooting Edge, JourneyFightSeries.com, United Protection Security Group. Our main event of the evening of Journey Fight Series Nine. You get a look over the head from the ring. Some of our great sponsors there and their logos in the ring. These two fighters resting up in preparation for this fourth round, scheduled for five rounds in three minutes. Both guys ready to go. Here we go for round four. Oh, jumping roundhouse kick by Campbell. Just, just grazes off of McKinnon. Body shot, but teeped. McKinnon with, oh, heavy roundhouse kick there by Campbell catching the ribs of McKinnon. McKinnon body hook, Campbell's following in. Oh, big left roundhouse kick by, by McKinnon. Off the arms, Campbell. Campbell picking away with that cut kick. You're seeing some tell, uh, telltale signs of that kick landing there on the thigh of McKinnon. McKinnon now locking up with Campbell, but nice teeth counter there by McKinnon. Heavy kick there by McKinnon, lands strong on Campbell's thigh. Campbell counters. <laughs> That's why you catch a glimpse, McKinnon shorts pull up there on his left leg. You yeah, you're really starting to see the, abuse. starting to see the, even on the inside of his uh, rear leg, he's got a little bit of uh, McKinnon, of course, having a very welting. fair complexion, all those shots yeah. show. Yeah, he's, he throws a little extra sunscreen on in the summer, I think Sean does that. Uh, definitely. <laughs> yeah. Cut heavy cut kick landed by Campbell there. McKinnon lands a heavy cross. Oh, both guys throwing a nice combo there. Both guys landed strong cut kicks. Teep to the face by Campbell. McKinnon throws, oh, eats one guy. for his trouble. Campbell's wanting to press. Kinger goes forward. Heavy cut kick wrapping around twice by the Campbell. And he times that one nicely. Eats a roundhouse kick to the ribs by McKinnon. Campbell takes the jab. Heavy cut kick again. Body hook, cut kick, really chopping that in. Oh, nicely done by McKinnon in return. Elbow, right hand, oh, heavy kick again by Campbell. McKinnon misses the right roundhouse kick. Campbell kicks, checked by McKinnon. McKinnon stepping forward, trying to find some range. Campbell taking that, taking that leg to school. Looks like Campbell might be starting to run out a bit of a gas here. Is McKinnon starting, oh, right heavy, heavy cut kick again by Campbell. Oh, caught in the ropes. 
and the clacker. That's it for this round, round four. Great round by both fighters. Looks like round Campbell smashing in the leg kick. Yeah, Campbell really found home for that cut kick. Uh, Sean doing some interesting things with his, uh, with his elbow work as he comes in close, but it's just not enough right now. He's gonna have to really turn it up here in round five. Campbell's breathing pretty heavy, but we got a good long two minute break here, only three minutes to go. These guys are professional athletes. He'll be ready to go for this third round. Very exciting fight. Uh, Sean McKinnon seeing some stuff he hasn't seen before, I think, from Shane Campbell and just the relentless attitude that he has. He keeps coming forward, coming forward nonstop. So, a look at our feature productions replay. You see Campbell opening the round with a bit of a jumping knee slash roundhouse that uh, got him dumped. You see McKinnon just missing with the teep to the face. Campbell coming in, looking for the short elbow on the left hand side there. And then Campbell returning the favor with a teep to the face as well. Tough fight to judge again. Fifth and final round. I expect this one will go the distance, go to the dredges cards. These guys are landing some blows, but uh, nobody's been in trouble at any point, any time throughout this fight. I'm, I'm looking for fireworks here in round five here, Rob. Yeah, I think it's going to be three minutes of nonstop these, action. These two are going to be trying to... Well, Shane Campbell, whether he's winning or not, always wants to put the hurt on you. He'd rather see you going out on a stretcher than go into a decision, which that's yeah. what makes for exciting fights. So. He likes to finish them. And uh, I think Sean may be a tad bit behind on points, and he's going to want to push. Campbell's recovery from when he sat down is pretty extraordinary here at this point. He was hoffing when he sat down, but he looks good now. Fifth and championship round for these two guys. Working their way. Final. Here we go. Last round of the fight. Oh, big right. Was that, I couldn't tell if that was an elbow or right hand. I'm oh, not nice sure. Heavy cut kick by McKinnon. Campbell really providing some movement here. Wanting to find a home again for that cut kick, and he is. Every time Sean steps forward to land that cross, he's eating that cut kick. Nice cut kick by, by McKinnon. Knee by Campbell. McKinnon just misses that elbow. Blocked up both fighters down to, the, down to the canvas with Campbell on top. Right hook, left knee by Campbell landed. McKinnon with a teep. Steps in with an elbow into the clinch, locked up. Heavy cut kick again for Campbell. Heavy cut kick, oh, both fighters landing heavy cut kick there. Oh, nice seat by McKinnon, steps oh, forward. Hard the body clinch. shot. Locked up by Campbell. McKinnon teeped off his game plan as he steps forward. Campbell's finding a home again for that cut kick. Both fighters starting to put the work in here. Last minute and a half of this fight. Halfway through this final round. Nice knee by, oh, caught him off balance as he went to throw the knee. Deep but oh, heavy cut kick there Hard by Campbell. Good, good combination by McKinnon. Hook to a kick and a heavy right kick. Oh, big uppercut lands by Campbell. He throws McKinnon off. McKinnon comes back with an elbow. Campbell backs off, steps in. Oh, big oh, heavy cross by McKinnon. Campbell ate it and come back up firing. Oh, heavy body hook. That one stung. McKinnon backed off. I don't know if it landed, if it's paralyzed the liver or not, but it dug deep. Oh, heavy kick. <laughs> Campbell eats it. Just, takes Just it like a off. cyborg. Straight up. What a tilt. Great fight by both fighters. Look at Campbell dig. McKinnon, oh, and takes the supporting leg. Last, oh, this is just a great tilt. Both main, boys going Fantastic hard. main event. Big elbow by Campbell. McKinnon, heavy kick. Both, both fighters just exhausted. Yeah, both fighters. 
Gavel swarming. Oh, great fight. Fantastic great fight, fight by both guys. So checking out the replay here, Campbell landing a nice kick to the sporting leg of uh, McKinnon and he's used for years. Judge, it's a terrific fight. Uh, by both combatants. I, I So the belt lying on the canvas, great fight for both fighters. Shane Campbell, Sean McKinnon, win, lose, or draw, great fight, and a great journey to get here by both fighters, so. Ladies and gentlemen, bouts upon bouts, elimination upon elimination brought us here tonight. And we have waited to see this. Put your hands together for a fantastic ending to the Journey Fight Series. One of these two gentlemen will be walking away with the belt and that $10,000 grand prize. The trophies and the bouts again brought to you by Team Smanich Muay Thai, Century Casino, Ensign Energy Services, Global Steel, The Shooting Edge, JourneyFightSeries.com, and United Protection Security Group, Inc. And we have a winner. Of this Journey Fight Series, and the $10,000 winner's purse, and the first ever 160 pound WMC North American champion by unanimous decision. In the blue corner, Shane Shaolin Campbell. Campbell. So a great fight and uh, just an overall great tournament for Shaolin Campbell and for Sean McKinnon. Nothing to hang your head about after that. That was just a epic battle, so.